Three American banks have failed in little more than a week, and the market is in shock. Silicon Valley Bank, Signature Bank and Silvergate Bank all got into trouble when the depositors started pulling out cash. The idea that banks can go under so quickly has called wild swings in the stock market, and particularly in the share prices of rivals like First Republic and Western Alliance. As the drama unfolds, here are three things to watch. First, the flight to safety. The authorities have promised that all deposited in banks that have been forced to shut down will get their money back. That stopped runs at other banks, but it won't work for everyone. The FDIC, which is the authority that backs bank deposits up to a value of $250,000, can only go beyond that for a bank that's already failed, and only then in special circumstances. So already super safe mega lenders like JP Morgan and Bank of America are being inundated with customer deposits. You can bet that because of this crisis, the big are going to get even bigger. Second, the big cleanup. Banks with nervous customers need to show that they're flush with cash, so the race is on to raise ready funds. The Federal Reserve has started a special lending program that lets banks borrow more freely, but some, like possibly First Republic, may try to sell themselves to a more stable rival, which is a more durable solution. But they're not selling from a position of strength. So expect takeovers, but potentially at painfully discounted prices. Lastly, the inflation conundrum. The current upheaval happened partly because the Federal Reserve raised rates to fight inflation, which slowed the economy and caused prices of financial assets to fall. Early this week, the market started to bet that maybe the Fed would change course rather than worsen a crisis. But inflation is still high at 6%, and while bank runs are bad, inflation, which penalises all Americans, and especially low-income households, is worse. It's not an easy call, but Fed Chair Jay Powell, who helped kick this whole crisis off, has limited options when it comes to fixing it.